pop up says Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family. Just thank you for just being you, just pushing out love and light, opening up, just stepping into your gift, embracing your gift, and you know, using it as a positive purpose. And with that being said, my le much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe, even hit that notification bell, so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you're comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback, the content of my video, or you're just up telling me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and seeing you towards a positive direction. Or if you feel like the video gave you good vibes and you want to share it with such and such, please go ahead and do so. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites. And thank you so much for the love and support. And I hope you're able to resonate with the concept of my video. And today I'm listening to 432 hertz of energy cleansing, uh, meditation, god dog, this is another, uh, theta binarial, uh, binarial beats, all chakra, uh, all chakra healing and detoxification. I ain't know I'd be hitting that many binarial beat links, but you know, they're all good or whatever. But anyways, who Jesus y'all, I'm um, like hot is, I don't know what, hotter than a fat baby, but so I don't know why I've been going through these really bad hot flashes. I guess it's that 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 sentient stuff, whatever. But anyways, my video today is about Twin Flame 101. Empaths, find your utopia. We need to. <laughs> we really need to. This is like, girl, you are crazy. Yes, we got to be ignorant. We we got to be ignorant. We got to be happy. No, I ain't saying we got to be ignorant for real, but. We do. We need to find that happiness. We need to find that blissful thing we need to have in our lives that open up our lives, make us want to do better, make us want to see others do better, you know, excel ourselves, you know, be in that good place. Because, I mean, it. I hate being miserable. I hate being around miserable people. You know, I wish I had just like a zapper. It's just like if you're negative, like I can just zap you. Just like, ah, just... You know, change you back to positive. You know, change you back to positive. You know, I wish I can do that when it comes to people. Because it's so ugly in this world. It's so ugly. And it's just like when I was telling y'all about the other video about um the night, the dark soul, or whatever. You know, that's kind of creepy. It's just like you're detaching yourself from everything. And it's just like your body is like going through all these changes and shocks like I was telling you the other day because it's just like when I go through stuff I start reading up on things starting to know why am I why am I functioning like this is this normal is it you know is it you know common for empaths to go through this does Hayokas do it because there's not that many things that's out there about us Hayokas so it's just like things that I go through you know basically you know others go through it too that you know, consider themselves hell good impasse. So it's just like we gotta find that peace of mind. We gotta find that happiness. And no matter how hard the hell it, we need to find it. Long as it's not out there hurting somebody, you need to find that positive, you know, positive space to be able to do what you need to do and be in a happy spot. So it's just like when we when we get to that. I mean, when we really need to get to it because we're desperate enough to get to it. And I know because I, I'm just like, I, I tell the universe, you know, I don't put that, you know, I don't, you know, I'm just like, you know, universe, I'm really ready to be in a happier spot. I'm really, really ready to have that peace of mind. And it's just like, you can't have it until you can get rid of all the negative thoughts, all the things that have done to you in the past, even though it's so horrible. You know, even though that's something that is hard for you, that comes through, through true strength to be able to get through something like that. And I, you know, and it was a thing, it was a YouTube clip that I seen. It, I mean, it really humbled the heck out of me. It, it broke my heart. But I was just like, you know what, these are really good people because it was this, I think they were either from India or Iraq, I can't remember. They weren't on this little bodega, I think in New York or something like that, and it, their son was a pizza boy. And 
the guy robbed him and killed him and took all his money and took his bike or whatever. And the parents end up forgiving that man. He was like, you know, I forgive you. Even though my son is not here, you know, it it's not going to bring my son back being mad at you. You know, and I was just like, you know, that's, that's, whew, mm-mm-mm. that's some forgiveness. You know what I'm saying? And I mean, I really felt good for them. And I mean, I cried my heart out, but that made me think, you know what, my parents, my adopted parents didn't kill him, even though it felt like they did with, with what they did. I have to find that in my heart to be able to forgive them. I got to find it in my heart to forgive my ex for all the stuff that he put, he has currently put me through and put me through. You know, I have to be able to forgive all that stuff. So it, it's just like when you you need to find that utopia in your life because it's like you know I always heard my mom always used to tell me, you know, no matter how angry you can be, that that anger shortens your life more than happiness will. <laughs> and it's sad because it will. Anger will shorten your life. You know, so it's just like we only got so many years or whatever. You know, where God see fit for us to be here. Find that utopia. Don't spend that time being mad. And I, I, I'm telling myself this as, as I'm telling you at the same time. I need to find my utopia and you need to find yours. So I hope you were able to resonate with the content of this video, y'all. Good God, it's hotter than a fat baby's butt. Even though I got all these fans on, I'm just like really hot flashing and very uncomfortable. But I hope y'all have a blessed week. And I hope y'all enjoyed your weekend. And send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm going to upload my next video. And, you know, this, this sweat is getting in my eyes. So that's why y'all keep seeing me sweat this eye. Because I'm like, oh my God. But anyways, you know, drop me a line. I love a chance to hear from you. Give me a thumbs up. Like and even share on your social media favorites. And know that you are blessed, truly favored, and straight up loved and knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days and my post notification shout out is to Tammy Zachowski I hope I pronounced your name right I apologize if I didn't boo but much love to you I hope you have a blessed day and I will talk to y'all later much love peace and be wild